Welcome to the kitchen. Over the past two decades, I've kept the secret. I'm the guy who is behind writing a lot of food infomercials you probably liked. I'm guessing that's the case because the shows I wrote and produced with my team have done over a billion dollars in product sales. And I've brought to you the Flavor Wave oven, the ultimate chopper, processors, great knife sets, pressure cookers, smartware flexible bakeware, sugar-free soda makers, you name it. But there's a couple of items I've really used in my personal kitchen for my family that have never seen the light of day on TV. Usually the company doesn't want to risk a big TV budget, but today I'm going to start opening my cupboard and showing the best cooking devices available that I use all the time. Now, what's the criteria? I have to love it and I have to use it. I have several to show you, but the series you're about to watch is about this device called the Vita Clay Cooker. Now, to prove to you that I use it, I wanna show you, this is actually my device. You can see this came from my kitchen and I've used it for 10 years and the dents and dings show how often I pull it in and out of the cupboard. Now, what the heck does it do? Well, what doesn't it do is a better question. I'm gonna chop this series into a bunch of pieces so you can binge watch until you break down and order one of these and you will want one, trust me. It's somewhere between a crock pot and a pressure cooker. Now, what that means is you can get the quality, flavor, and tenderness of a crock pot with the near speed of a pressure cooker. Now, this is my crock pot and I threw out my Instapot Insta because frankly, it was a pain in the ass. This is easier and better because you can safely open it while you're cooking and add ingredients. Add veggies at the end so they're fresh and nutritious with the vitamins and flavor. Nothing aggravates me more than green beans that are gray or broccoli that's slimy and gray. Over this video series, I'm gonna to prove to you that you can cook fast and get great rave results. Not mess up the kitchen and eat foods that you love that your mom and your grandma probably made. Every ethnic dish I love can be made in here. We'll make easy osobuco, lamb, beef or veal, barbecue ribs. Now there's a trick to this. Pot roasts, pork roasts, roasted chickens, and keto paleo friendly bone broths with remaining bones from everything. Now this is the most idiot proof cooker, which is why mine is so beat up. You'll use it all the time. Pulled pork, chicken, and beef for street tacos or enchiladas. I'll show you how to make those in here. Pork verde, Italian meatballs, one pot pastas, like Italian sausage and penne and tomato sauce, Mediterranean dishes, slow cooked meats, but it's not just meats. You'll make chilies, soups, chowders, okay? Let's get started. Let's do something delicious. All right, now let's cook something fun here. This is osobuco, one of my favorite dishes. Now, normally I would make this with four uh, lamb shanks, veal shanks, or um, beef shanks. But today I'm only making two because there's only gonna be two of us eating. The pot easily holds four. Now inside the Vita Clay, there is this clay pot insert. And that's what we're cooking in, is an insulated clay insert with air going around it to heat it slowly yet rapidly. So first we just put in our two shanks. And you can hear the sizzle because I've already warmed up the cooker. This is one of the unusual things about this cooker. You can have it on while it's open. Now you can't do that with a pressure cooker. Now the recipe is simple. By the way, I learned how to use a can opener properly recently. And look, have. Put your can opener down sideways when you use it. It's a can of diced tomatoes. Perfect. Then, cup of white wine. Then, chopped garlic. Now there's a lot of ways to buy garlic. This is the way that I buy it now. I used to peel and chop and torture myself with garlic and it's just frankly easier. There, I peeled off the lid. That's all the peeling I'm gonna do. I have a heaping teaspoon of garlic in there. Go around. And this is how I buy my herbs now. You can get these in the produce department. I used to be a grocer. And fresh herbs go bad so fast in my fridge. I've just learned to buy the Italian herbs in the tube. Or you'll see me use a lot in this series 
um, herbs that I buy at, at cost plus. So uh, I use a lot of herbs de Provence, taught to me by my friend, Chef Jacques Boireau. A little sea salt, a little pepper. Okay, and then chopped celery stock. One small chopped onion and one carrot chopped. Hey, look, I got a nub in there. Perfect, Just put the lid on. Now, the cooker was probably originally designed to be a rice cooker, but I found it so versatile, I literally use it for almost everything. This is set to soup. For two hours, we close the lid and simply hit start and we're off and running. That's it. Now here's the deal with this. The Vita Clay is a terracotta clay pot. Inside here, there's a heating element, but there's a cushion of air around it like a thermos. So I made sure that the bone in the meat is in contact with the terracotta to transfer the heat slowly through the bone. And that's what makes it so tender. The top you'll see has these vents. Now this vent allows water to escape as water vapor. So your sauces and your soups will get nice and thick and rich. Now, when you shut the lid, I set it to cook for two hours for this recipe. Now that could be lamb, veal. You could even do a whole cut up chicken this way. All right, now to plate this up, first I've uh, just got a little quick cook polenta. So you actually could have done this. I could have done this in the pot, but I like to cook my polenta just so it's clean and prettier. So it's nice and golden. Maybe put a little butter on that later, but let's take a look at our osamoko. And this little hook comes with your Vita Clay. All right, oh, look at this baby. Here, I'm gonna tip this up so you can see this. Now, I want you to know there wasn't any trickery or treachery in what we did. This is exactly as you saw it go into the pot, right? You can see all those oils and juices and flavors that have cooked off. I might even reserve those bones later, come back and make bone broth with them. Oh, baby. See, so you gotta be careful taking this out now because it will want to fall off the bone. Oh, and it does. It wants to come off the bone. Look at that. Oh, yum. Look at this one. Ah, beautiful and tender. See that meat coming right off the bone? Look at that. It's just coming right apart. Oh, but you can't stop there because there's a lot of good stuff inside the bowl. Look at that nonsense. Oh, baby, that is going to be delicious. I'm gonna use the spoon here. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try this in a second because I don't care. That's why I cooked it was to eat it, right? So let's uh, make it a little pretty for our guests. Now, if you hear any scratching or howling in the background, we got some dogs here, and our dogs are going crazy in the background, which I think is kind of funny. All right, and green parsley. Now, you saw that took about 30 seconds, two minutes to make. It's just minutes. And now, we're done. Wouldn't you feel proud serving that to somebody? Now, I'm gonna take a little bite. Pardon me, but I gots to. Mm. You know what, I want to get a little polenta on there. Dig down in there. Mmm! Oh, golly. I might have to take the rest of the day off. That is absolutely, absolutely incredible. Mmm! Oh my God. That is incredible. So here we have a very low effort, inexpensive, excellent, meal for two or four if you just add two more chops to it. Now this is great and it's something that complements everything. One last thing, the Vita Clay has a timer. Since it's insulated, you can feel completely safe putting this together in the morning, say early on a weekend day and set the timer so it starts cooking five hours from now and it'll switch to a warming mode for several hours after the cooking cycle's complete. So you have ease, versatility, and an incredibly beautiful, delicious, elegant meal. Make a decision to jump onto our next cooking installment or go to the page and use my promo code to get $100 off this incredible cooking tool, which is a huge savings and a bundle of free gifts you'll use and love.
Thanks for watching. Bye now.